Well, after experiencing the loss of a loved one, it can be difficult to move forward. Well, Nine on your side's Greg Bradbury shows us one group here in Tucson helping those go from grief to joy. Each day, hundreds of cars drive by the Desert Hope Lutheran Center. But few take the drive down the road behind the church to the Hope Center. Sherry Caius did. I didn't know what to do with myself. All I did was cry. All I did was feel bad. And then when I came here, after the fourth session, and it's four weeks in a row that you're here, you're here every Saturday, I just felt like, this is gonna, I'm gonna be okay. I'm gonna be all right. It's gonna work. And it did. Sherry knows grief. Last year, her husband of 35 years was diagnosed with stage four cancer. They said we had weeks to months and we had three days. So, so it was tough. Sorry. Sorry and Diane saved me. This Diane's program, Diane and getting us all through this, it, it made it so I could get up and go. Yeah. At the Hope Center on Saturdays, they offer grief counseling services. Diane Shalinsky has been facilitating the program for over a decade, helping hundreds of people, many of whom aren't church members, find hope. This is a long journey and you really need to walk the journey. Uh, it's painful for sure, um, but I think that's the only way that you truly put it in the past and you'll always remember, but not with the intensity that you did. When the pandemic started, chairs sat empty, but now groups are back to support each other on the journey from mourning to joy. I mean, you grow and you grow and you grow, but each time you go through it, you grow a little more. You, you get a little more out of it. I, I felt like I could lift my head off the table. Helping Sherry and others find hope after grief. Greg Bradbury, KGUN 9, on your side. And the next session of Grief Share will uh, start on May 7th. The groups are from 1 to 2.30 in the afternoon each Saturday. They use videos, workbooks, and group discussion to help move forward. Now, you don't have to be a member of the church or even religious to attend. What a nice program yeah, that is. Yeah, wow. it is.